when you die and you cross to the other side, you will be judged by the things that Jesus Christ spoke. I want to read to you what Jesus said in John chapter 12, verse 47 and 48. If anyone hears my words and does not believe, I do not judge him. For I did not come to judge the world, but to save the world. He who rejects me and does not receive my words has that which judges him. The word that I have spoken will judge him in the last day. Many people, including Christians, do not know the words that they will be judged by because they don't know the words of Jesus. They are blind. And because they say they see, they say they do know the words of Jesus, their sin remains because they know exactly the things that he requires of them, but they do not do it. I want to read to you what Jesus says. And this is John chapter 12, verse 25. He who loves his life will lose it. And he who hates his life in this world will keep it for eternal life. I want to tell you that most people, including Christians, have never crossed over. They have never made this transition. They love their lives, and from the time they were born, they have been Christians, and they have never made that transition from loving their life to hating it. Many people have been Christians their whole life and they have never seen that transition from loving their life to hating it. I have seen that transition myself. It has been both devastating and wonderful. Have you ever crossed over to the other side and seen what Jesus has to offer as I have? Or are you like the majority of Christians that have never crossed to the other side, but they just assume they will be saved because they were born Christians, they have been raised in church, and they know the Bible. And though they are blind, they say that they see, and because they see, their sin remains. Make sure that you really cross to the other side. Otherwise, you will not have life, but you will have everlasting torment in the place called the lake of fire. Make sure that you reconcile with the Creator, because He did not come to judge you and to destroy you, but He came to save your soul. Make sure you're not like the Christians who have never crossed over, but really cross over and see what's on the other side with Jesus. People may hate you, the world will despise you, but you will have everlasting life with Jesus.